we value them not no, we value the sellers to me. We value sellers. You said, you said selection in the way. What do you think it's selection? No, it's a combination of the two. That's why you are trying to give me trust. Hey, so I want to say the idea. That's why I'm here to listen to your... So you're not saying, you're not valuing the number above the average. Right. 
if you're a seller or an agent for a college or a company, you can you in it. That's a year of So you should be, probably by the mid of that year, you would have the 100. <laughs> Okay, so if they are having any questions or if they would um, reclassify the first as a challenge, then you encourage them to be top rated sellers. Because for a top, so, uh, top rated seller, it's a fixed. 20 percent yeah. discount. Wow. So it's five or 20 feet. Yes, it's five or 20 feet now. So you encourage them to be top rated sellers, and then that's going to be a 20 percent fixed final value fee discount. They will also have the top rated ribbon on all their listings, <coughs> and they have exclusive access to the feature for the media. It's not for Right now, it's, it's available for everyone, right? Yeah. But then, come October, it's not going to be available for everyone. Mm -hmm. So, by then, if, if top rated sellers would use these shirts first, then there is a greater chance that they will be featured first. They cannot be featured. It will be great out if they don't call it by team. It's not an option for those that do not qualify. Where's the RCR? Mm. Only well, the top rate that are good. Only top rate that sellers can use feature first. Right? So any other members lesser than top rate sellers, they cannot use the feature first. Okay? So this are the requirements to be part of our program. Now for all sellers, they just have to maintain a maximum of one and two from US buyers for item as described, and that's the three percent for communication shipping time and shipping costs at four percent. How do we calculate that? We will discuss later. But that also is dependent on the number of transactions that they have. Right? Yes. Now for power sellers, they have to meet all the requirements for sellers, regular sellers. So they have to have 3% and then 4% for the rest of the sellers. Are. And then maintain an average score of 4.5 or higher, which is going to be 4.6 in April, but for the intent, 4.5. And then have a feedback score of 98% or higher. They also have either to have 1,000 worth of sales for three, month, um, three months with the two transactions per month. Do you understand? 